Hi guys, and thanks again for tuning into my channel. Today I'm gonna be going down a memory lane, and I'm basically gonna go back to how I used to do my videos back when I first started my natural hair channel. Thumbs up this video if you guys have been following me since then. I went natural in 2008. That's crazy, I can't even remember. So I've been natural for 12 years now, and I've been locked for two and a half years. So my hair has always been pretty thick ever since I was a kid. I got a relaxer when I was 12 years old and I stayed relaxed for eight years and went natural at 20 years old. These two pictures are me after 12 years natural. I couldn't really get past shoulder length and it was just really frustrating. So I was used to put my hair back in a bun. This was my husband's favorite style. Even on my wedding day, I wore my natural hair, but I got pregnant after we got married and Nala took up all of my time. I had no time to actually do my natural hair. So I started to wear a lot of wigs and I started to experiment with that, which was really fun, but I wanted to get back to caring for my natural hair. So I went on a natural hair journey, but like a protective style natural hair journey. There's a video on my page about that too. But after seven months of trying to grow my natural hair, I still didn't really achieve much length. So the same day that I got my hair straightened for the last time, I chose to start my lock journey. So from this salon visit, I just went home, I wet it, and I put the two strand twist in myself. So I'm gonna let you guys watch that process. And it really made me happy that my daughter was going to be able to see me accepting my natural hair in its natural state and just being okay with being fully natural and locked. There were some days where I really loved how they looked and other days when I was like, what is this? This is one of those days, but I just struggled through it and I chose to be confident and I chose to rock it regardless of how it looked. I noticed that the ends of my hair got really thin, lost some of the curl, like every stage was not the best, but I'm so happy that I just stuck with it. This is one year different. So as you can see, it grew like an inch, maybe an inch and a half. It wasn't much growth because as your hair is locking and budding, it's also shrinking. So you're not gonna experience a lot of growth or see a lot of growth in the first year. Your hair is growing, but it has to shrink. It has to bud in order for it to lock. So as it's growing, it's shrinking. So it really, you really won't see a lot of growth at all. So this is after one year and around this time i really started to love my hair pretty much every day yes there were some days where it looked a little rough but i knew a retwist was right around the corner so i was okay with it i actually liked my hair when it wasn't freshly retwisted and i liked it when it was freshly retwisted they both came with pros and cons when it wasn't freshly retwisted it looked a lot thicker when it was, it looked a lot neater. Um, I wore a lot of hats during this time just because, I, to be honest, I wasn't fully confident in um, how my hair looked all the time. So days when I just did not want to deal with it, I would just throw a hat on. My favorite style after being locked for one year was a high bun with two bangs. I really loved this style. I thought it was easy to dress up and it was also really easy to make it look casual and cute. 
I really love the space buns, two space buns in the front and down in the back. Two space buns with bangs. I experimented with head wraps and I just had a lot of fun with my hair in year one. Like between year one and year two, really no complaints at all. My hair started to bud, it started to fall down and I was able to do a lot more styles with it. So it was really, really fun. And I loved how when it was wet, it seemed a little bit longer and when it was dry, it would shrink up a little bit. So I got to play around with it looking like a bob and looking a little bit longer than a bob. This day was really significant for me. We were invited to one of my husband's friend's weddings and it was so easy for me to put my hair up into a low bun and I just looked so elegant. I used to think that locks weren't gonna allow me to look elegant when I wanted to. I don't know why I thought that, but it definitely transitioned into an elegant look really easily. And I was super happy about that. So these pictures were taken about six months ago. So I was two years locked during these pictures. Again, no complaints with this stage. I remember telling my husband, if my hair just stops growing right now, like knock on wood, but if it does, I'd actually be really happy with this length and this thickness. I love my hair, how it looks right now. And I have no complaints. When I saw how my ponytail looked in this shot, I was so shocked. I wish I would've took a longer video than just this, but wow, it got really thick and really long. And this was me yesterday, so now you guys are fully caught up. Please hit that like button if you like this video, subscribe for more videos, check out some of my retwist videos. One of my videos got over 2 million views, that's crazy. I'm gonna talk about that one day, but I still can't believe it. Anyways, guys have a good day. Love you guys, bye.